I do enjoy Hawaiian slack key music. I am Gerard Sudakawa. Uh, I go by Jerry, and I'm an artist sculptor. My father was an artist and also an art educator. He was very interested in the arts. My father's designs were all these very soft volumes. He rarely used a hard edge or a straight line. Well, I started working for my father in the studio at the age of about 23. In 1971, I helped in the shop to fabricate uh, a fountain that he did for Pacific First Federal Bank in Bellevue, Northeast Bay Street. I think I was um, unconsciously immersed in art. You know, my father was a fairly strong shadow to, to work underneath. I wanted to distinguish myself. Well, I really feel like, you know, I've created my own identity. A lot of people are familiar with my mitt sculpture at T-Mobile Park. People will uh, lean, sit, or take their selfies with it. My philosophy is if it's a public art, then the public should be able to interact with it. Tumbi is actually the name of a bird, and it has a kind of a spread, uh, like it's going to fly. That's where its name came from. As you walk around the sculpture, there's no two views that are the same. It's constantly changing. I'm really happy the way that turned out. A lot of my creativity and ideas come from dreams. The current piece is uh, my Sea Wave piece. It was an open call for artists for the uh, uh, Climate Pledge Arena for art proposals. I created this small bronze, and this represents the ocean waves breaking around in a continuous circle. This is a chance for, for my, my sculpture to speak to the idea of that um, the ocean is such an important part of our environment. The Wing Luke Museum is a wonderful place. I did the canopy and the door pools. This is a six foot tall bronze and uh, I want it to be very inviting and soft. My uh, Wing Luke exhibit uh, opened in June and it's going to be up for nine months and it gave me a chance to actually look back at 40 years of making bronze sculptures. So there's maquettes of a lot of the uh, uh, larger works that are around town. Also there's a representation of the mitt sculpture, so go see it. <laughs> I'm getting up there in age, I'm going to be uh, 74 pretty quick, but I enjoy doing the work and I have a, no idea when it'll end. You know, when you have a job that's fun and interesting, you know, you just want to keep doing it.